fighter introductions. In the red corner, she is five feet, three inches tall, weighing in at 156 pounds. From Innovative Martial Arts in Westminster, Colorado, please welcome Melissa Hutchison. And in the blue corner, she is five feet, five inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. From Beverly Hills Jiu-Jitsu in LA, California, please welcome Myra Condi. This is a women's kickboxing match. Melissa Hutchison in the white shirt and Myra Condi in the black singlet. And uh, Myra, not a kickboxer, a Valetudo fighter. She only has actually one or two Valetudo fights under her belt. Has only been training for a couple of months, but really wanting to get into the game. And uh, Melissa, unwilling to do a Valetudo matchup, but perfectly willing to do uh, her discipline, which is kickboxing. So, Condi, obviously uh, an accomplished athlete so we'll see how her skills can be transferred over here to the kickboxing absolutely just amazingly muscled you can just see the legs that if she got a good technique and got a good kick uh, anything she hits is going to take some pounding look at those thighs just enormous powerful and uh, melissa not wanting to uh, engage and i don't blame her a bit Ooh, left and right from condi melissa trying to cover up here Taking those are heavy blows yeah, yeah, not, not super technical, but good, powerful kicks and punches coming right at her, and uh, Melissa not able to move out of the way. Oh, Melissa with a successful front leg kick there. Very good. Caught Condi as she had just lifted her right leg for a kick and knocked her balance off from under. Exactly, that shows Melissa's got the skills. She can't be overestimated, or underestimated, rather. If Myra does that too often, she uh, may find herself in a real uh, world of hurt. Myra circling right now looking for a chance to come in and Melissa wearing the headgear at this point wants to protect the, the old noggin Myra stalking trying to find an opening good block by uh, Hutchison simultaneous kicks coming in but getting those jabs that sneak through the arms Melissa keeping her arms up oh, oh, good left knocked to the right. chin, almost knocked the ground Whoa. The punches keep coming keep it coming in Melissa lowering her head now. Those are painful. Now she's got a knee attack going there. Melissa firing knees up into Myra, but they don't seem to be hitting perfectly solid. They're just coming up and bouncing off. Now they Not switch devastated. positions. Condi with some wicked right hooks. Rights and lefts and rights. The headgear turned a little sideways. Melissa seems like she needs some tending too, so we're going to give her a standing eight count and make sure she can continue before the fight goes on. Melissa seems to be vulnerable because she's uh, trying to adjust her headgear, and that's when Condi takes advantage. Absolutely. Well, referee John Wingo says she's ready to go, and uh, so we're ready to watch her. Fighters measuring off again. Melissa keeping her hands very high. I'm not sure how that affects the power of the punches coming through, but it uh, seems to leave her body wide open, which Myra just... Uh, Kicked her. Oh, another left and right from Myra. Oh, another one. Oh, right. those head, those head shots. Her head is just bouncing back like a speed bag. What a chin on on Hutchison. But oh, she okay. comes back with a couple of punches of her back. own. Myra having to back away. Knees Blocking to the body of Hutchison. Knees. knees blocking knees. <laughs> I can tell that Myra wants to tie up and throw her to the ground. She wants to grab it. She wants to turn this into a Valley Tito matchup, which she can't do. It's the end of the first round. You'll see champion Bass Rutten in the corner along with Oscar Martinez and Dwayne Lovely. Seems like it. Myra's got everyone over there. Tommy Johnson, the coach over there for Melissa Hutchison, a very talented uh, local trainer. Trying to tell Melissa to step up her pace, get some shots in, protect her head more. Absolutely. Those, oh, those shots, just watching her head snap back like that, just like, oh, it makes me sick, it makes me painful. It makes me very worrisome. But I think she's going to be okay. Pace slowed down a little bit now, Fighters. possibly catching their wind. Yeah, they did have a one-minute break in between these rounds, but maybe they want a little bit more. Attempted a leg kick by Condi, blocked by Hutchison. 
Oh, and she goes ahead. back to the punches. Going back upstairs again, and Melissa just taking oh! oh, a big run. Oh, my gosh. Unbelievable. I can't believe Melissa's still in this. Thanks. Another, oh, my gosh. Caught her while she was adjusting her headgear again. Adjusting that headgear. It keeps on turning on her, and every time she turns, just like she's been taught to, Myra follows up. Bam! Goes upstairs, and Melissa... Well, I don't know if she's going to be able to continue or not. Referee's going to check it out. He says he's ready to go. Clear. Boy, oh boy, that headgear is saving her life. That is all I can say. Myra feeling in. Myra just looks like a shark circling her prey. She just looks like she's coming in. Melissa, turning her head. You cannot do that. Nope, it leads it wide oh. open for shots like just that. Just like that. And she's touching oh, Myra. Oh, lefts and rights and, and knees. knees. Everything is coming in. Upstairs, this, downstairs. This fight needs to end very soon. And Wingo is going to take a look at her and, and calls the Wingo fight. Wingo calls the fight. Ladies Myra Condi, our women's kickboxing champion, came here for the Valetudo fight. Mira. Wins a kickboxing Andy. fight. Heart, an absolute Let's big heart big on big Melissa just to stay in this. But a great fight by Myra Condi. Congratulations, Myra. Good job.